Legislative IQ. Increase your legislative intelligence with Florida's policy, budget, and campaign monitoring service. Subscribe today at legislativeiq.com. About 125 insurers marched on the state capitol to spread the word about an issue they say is driving up insurance rates in the state. When you sign a form to allow your doctor to bill your insurance company, you're doing what's called assignment of benefits. When it comes to home repairs, similar agreements are often hidden in the repair contracts. Often they allow a contractor to sue a person's insurer without their consent or knowledge. Insurers say some attorneys are abusing the system. In my opinion, there's huge fraud here. Lawsuits filed on behalf of homeowners have increased by 6,800 percent since 2006. The ultimate payer in this situation is the consumer. It's that simple. They will pay the price. Otherwise, you won't have an insurance company that will do business in the state. The House has passed a bill that would allow people to back out of assignment of benefit agreements. It would also put restrictions on when attorneys can collect fees. Jeff Grant owns Bone Dry Restoration and Cleaning. He says he's lowballed by almost every insurer he deals with. If they can save 50 bucks and doing the wrong thing, then they're going to try to save 50 bucks. They don't truly take the consumer into, into account in any of this. He says assignment of benefits helps him recover full costs and ensures consumers' repairs are up to standard. Florida's ranked the state with the fifth worst legal climate in the country. Insurers say assignment of benefits fraud is a major factor in the ranking. In Tallahassee, I'm Jake Stofan.